Dream Channel. Thanks so much for tuning in. I hope you are all well and as you can tell from the title, today's vlog is going to be a H&M haul, which I will be trying everything on to give you all an idea on size reference and what they look like in terms of fit. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, have watched a few of my hauls before, you will know I am loungewear obsessed. So, this is pretty much loungewear, if I'm honest. There, there isn't many pieces in there that are like dressy, obviously. I mean, one, we're still in lockdown and we don't really have anywhere to go. Two, lockdown or not, I'd probably only get loungewear anyway because I'm obsessed with all things joggers, knitwear, comfy clothes. Yes, so with that being said, this is pretty much a full H&M loungewear haul. And as always, H&M are 110% killing it. I tried to actually rein myself in and stay away from H&M um, for a little while now. Um, but then the other night I found myself on their website and I couldn't help, couldn't help it. Just It just happened. Everything fell into my basket and just got delivered to my door. So here we are. Anywho, I will not ramble on for too long because I tend to do that. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel then please don't forget to subscribe down below and I'll also pop my Instagram up on the page now where you will see a lot of these outfits come to life on my feed. So thanks so much for watching guys and let's get on with the video. Now I did buy a lot of kind of sets. When I usually do buy anything new I do try to kind of get like top and bottoms to match um otherwise i always find myself thinking what am i going to put with this so you know, that's how i've kind of done it in this range and to be honest i've actually gone and bought some jeans and i didn't know i forgot first up we have this kind of a two-piece knitwear set uh, it's like ripped material and it just looked unbelievably comfortable um so we have the t-shirt i got this in a size small um and i think on the actual kind of size reference on H&M, it did say it was kind of on like the larger side. So I kind of stuck to a small, which I'm actually quite glad I did um, because it is quite oversized, which is what I love. But if I went for it, usually I would have gone for a medium if it was a like kind of spot on size. Um, so I sized down in this, which I'm glad. And it's still really nice and cosy and comfy. Um, and I've got a lot of room in it, which is what I absolutely love. I do love things to be like quite oversized. I like that kind of look. Um, so yeah, so this is a gorgeous soft knit ribbed top long sleeve and um, just a standard kind of neckline um and it's gorgeous it's so soft i'm in love um super cozy just an amazing fit i love kind of like the top and bottoms together like the whole kind of set it just screams comfort to me and to be honest i would easily wear this either as pajamas or just pop a pair of chunky trainers with it and kind of like a nice coat um either like a black puffer jacket or a teddy coat oh, love a teddy coat and then just pop out the house and you're still looking stylish uh, so yeah so this is the top and the bottoms are again exactly the same material um, and there we have it these are the bottoms now i got a size extra small in the bottoms and i distinctly remember it's because it was, there was only one pair left and i thought i'm just gonna wing it and see what they actually look like and um, because it's an elasticated waist bit of stretch in there um so i'm kind of hoping they fit and they don't look and they're not too uncomfortable i actually saw this on is it perry walker's instagram um because like her outfit in sports is just amazing and i've been avoiding her page basically so i don't buy everything um so yeah i saw them on her feed and basically went and bought them um and it was the only size left now i'm just kind of hoping they're not too you know restricted um so yeah these are the bottoms that actually match the top again so soft gorgeous they've kind of got like a bit of a bootleg bottom they were 17.99 each for the top and the bottom so for a really good quality uh soft knit set i think that's quite good um so yeah in love with this little set absolutely adore it um, for kind of like a size reference for the trousers um for the, like the leg length i am five foot one and a half um so yeah they fit quite well i thought they were going to be extremely long um because that's always my problem um but they weren't as long as i thought which is always a bonus um however it's more kind of like the waist for me um i mean 
obviously if there was more sizes i would have got my normal size a uh, size like small um but because there wasn't many there was an extra small so i'm not too sure about these um i'll see how i get on but i might have to end up return them and get in a small when they come back in stock but that's the first set now i also just did buy a pair of ribbed again ribbed material these are just a plain black pair of flared leggings i am obsessed with flared leggings at the moment i have a pair that was also from h&m um they were kind of like a charcoal like a light charcoal color um but yeah flared leggings with a matching hoodie uh to go with it and i live in i live in that set and i tried to find kind of like another a similar set but there wasn't any hoodies that kind of matched the leggings that i wanted um so i just did get a pair of basic black flared leggings that i could match with pretty much everything and anything in my wardrobe so i am obsessed with these i got these in a size medium um which i think that's what my last pair were in so i think i just kind of scaled it off there and my other set fit great uh, these ones are gorgeous uh super soft love the material and like i said it's kind of like that brush ribbed fabric um and i love the fit i would always wear my flare leggings with kind of like a chunky boot or a chunky trainer depending on what i've got on on the top um and yeah super happy with these and these were 9.99 i did also pick up another pair of just like random leggings uh, i actually saw these on a different bloggers feed this time kirsty ma um i'm obsessed with her style and she's just a wonderful person anyway so i spotted these on her stories and she linked them so of course i was gonna buy them um so yeah these i got these in a size small actually i'm all over with the sizes aren't i i think because everything is kind of like selling out so quickly i'm just kind of nabbing a random size and hoping that they fit and they look okay but yeah these ones again quite a good and nice elastic waist these are just a pair of cotton leggings um in kind of like a beige beige tone neutral vibes all around i love these super soft they're not like a see-through material or anything like that and it's kind of like a skinny bottom um instead of flared this time and i love these i specifically bought these to kind of go with a lot of my kind of cream knitwear jumpers um i just think it's nice to have like a different colored pair of leggings all my leggings are pretty much black or i have that one pair of charcoal and it's quite nice to get a different kind of colored pair of leggings like i say i'm going to match these with a lot of my knitwear jumpers in cream i just think it kind of has more of a neutral tone to it so i really love these these were 12.99 um and i am obsessed so i love these ones they fit great i love how they look just super flattering and um, so really really happy with these i also did pick up a, another set um of leggings and a hoodie of course these are another pair of cotton leggings and um, they are just literally the same style of these ones here they're just a different color they're more of like a charcoal color so here they are like i said the same style um same material um skinny bottom i honestly love them super soft so cozy so comfy I love leggings like i absolutely love leggings i genuinely live in leggings um i got these in a medium as well the same as the neutral pair so yeah it's more of like kind of like a charcoal color and i spotted these um on the leggings section then the model on the website had the kind of like a matching hoodie to go with it um which i thought looked great it was a really nice kind of set and i was obsessed and hooked straight away so i popped the hoodie in my basket too um so yeah these were 12.99 as well the same as the um neutral ones and the hoodie yes so the hoodie that i picked up again in the charcoal color this is kind of like an oversized long hoodie i was a little bit dubious about buying it because i am i'm not that tall um so i wasn't too sure how i was gonna look um but it's so cozy so comfy and it matches the leggings i don't care it looks great i love it i'm cozy i'm not bothered um i can totally just wear it in the house it's fine um so i picked this up in a size small because it was oversized and long um i probably could have got away with getting an extra small if i'm honest because it is quite big it is quite oversized but nevertheless it's really nice it's gorgeous it's so soft it's nice and thin so it's not it's not too thick and it's not like a fleece inline or anything like that which to be fair sometimes i do like even in the winter because i feel like when i pop a hood like a jacket on over the top i don't get too hot i kind of have like a nice happy medium um so yeah so the jumper like i said i picked up in a size small and it was 24.99 um so i am 
obsessed but nice matching set there with the leggings and the hoodie and lastly i forgot i picked up jeans so i was scrolling through the knitwear section and found a beautiful little jumper it's kind of just like a normal neckline jumper um but there was only an extra small left it's typical standard me i picked it up anyway i thought i'll see what it looks like you know because you never know um because it, it did look a little oversized on the photos and then the model was wearing je the, like the matching mom jeans with them gorgeous um so i ended up picking up the jeans too because i loved the kind of look that it has and I'm, i don't own a pair of mom jeans which i'm slightly offended by myself that i haven't actually picked a pair of mom jeans up in my entire life yet um so i now have a pair fingers crossed they fit and look okay so this is the jumper um actually that's actually yeah i'm quite glad i managed to get an extra small because it, like i said it did look quite oversized on the website and um, so i just picked them picked it up in a size extra small which actually does look okay i don't know if you can see it is i feel like it's gonna like fit to be honest and um, so we've kind of got like the puffer sleeves quite large sleeves and then a bit of kind of like detail down here on the opposite side of the sleeve and then just standard kind of neck and yeah i love this nice little knitted jumper um this was 19.99 which i don't think is that bad really for a nice quality knitted jumper i really do love this one i love all of h&m's knitwear jumpers to be fair i've got so many um it's it's a problem i'm not gonna lie i've got loads like i honestly don't need another neutral jumper i really don't i've got loads it's an obsession it's a problem but we're gonna buy it anyway because it's fine it's okay it matches the jeans and i don't have one that matches those jeans that's what i'm gonna say anyway so this is the jumper and these are the mom jeans they're like a light blue denim oh and i always love it when they have like the little denim patch on the back i think that looks super cool it just kind of adds to the jeans um and they are loose fit mom jeans quite like a straight leg all the way down um and then instead of a zip it's all buttoned all the way up and i got these in a uk 10 and um, which is my normal size for jeans um i always struggle with jeans because i'm kind of like a different size on my waist to my legs so if i'm like a 10 on my waist nine times out of ten i won't be a 10 on the leg and vice versa it's really annoying I'm always quite dubious buying jeans online because i keep thinking do i get an eight do i get a 10 or do i get a 12 i never really know i'm honestly i am borderline between all three and the past i want to say two times i've bought jeans i've got a 10 and it's been okay and um, they fit really well so fingers crossed these do absolutely love them and i think it'll look genuinely perfect with the top i think it's just a really kind of nice cash yet stylish um outfit for the whole day i would probably pair this with kind of like depending on where i was going but the model on the website had kind of like a pair of uh, loafers on or brogues which i think looks great um but obviously i'm not really going anywhere nice enough to wear a pair of uh, loafers or anything like that at the moment so i would probably just pair them with like a pair of converse or like white trainers like bands that kind of thing um and i think that would look quite nice as well uh so yeah in love in love jeans are gorgeous yet because of the size um unfortunately they did not fit which is a shame see this is the issue that i mentioned guys and as you can tell with the video as well the jumper just was not very flattering it just looked awful on me jumper was just like it was it was big but it was also just not flattering at all it just didn't it did not suit me one little bit so unfortunately they are both going back absolutely good that they don't fit fully never mind okay guys that is the end of my h&m haul um i am obsessed with everything i bought obviously if you didn't already notice i will link everything in the description box for you all if you want to have a little browse or treat yourself to a few of these items thanks so much for watching i hope you all enjoyed it if you made it to the end of the vlog thank you so much and as always guys do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel below and stay tuned for the next video bye